Good morning, you too. Hey, haven't talked to you guys for a long time. It's time. It's been a while. It's been a while. Crew's rolling out this morning. Ooh, that mower's got some dirt. Mud. What's up, David? Morning. This is what happens when you have three companies coming uh, in and out in the morning. I'm really glad to be back, man. I really am. I, uh, I have a lot to uh, catch up with you guys, but uh, bottom line is I'm looking forward to uh, kind of going back into the YouTube thing. It's been a long time. And we had to dig a trench. See? Look at this. Kind of sucks. We uh, had some issues with our power, so we had to run a new power line to the building, which, you know, that's always fun. Got a problem with one of our mowers this morning. It looks like we might have a PTO issue on that. And one thing hasn't changed is the mornings are always, you know, one thing after another. All right, one thing I'm doing here is I'm gonna hang up some testimonials right here so that my, uh, my crew can see them. I have some nice emails that came in. Um, actually, a uh, verbal testimonial I got from a client walking the, uh, their property, commercial property the other day. So uh, I'm going to put them right here on this board. This is our foreman room where everybody comes in in the morning. And uh, I want everybody to see it, you know. We like to put the good, uh, we have to talk about the bad too. What I like to see, emails, testimonials, people saying how nice we do uh, out there for them. It's important, very important. I like this. If you're not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you're determined to learn, no one can stop you. All right, gang, heading out to uh, do a few things, make a few stops, do a few sales calls, and uh, probably check on a couple of the crews while we're out. You got to have coffee. I mean, that's part of the deal. You don't want to get run over with the drive through traffic. All right, gonna check out a job here in a few. See All right, um, I got a just a small mulch job here. I mulch these beds behind me and then across the street. So I uh, got to grab a price for this for the uh, homeowner. It's kind of what I like about what I do. I mean, I get to I, I get to do a lot of different things. Like my first stop today is to look at these uh, these beds. Uh, get a price, send it off to the HOA. Then I'm probably going to do uh, some sales calls and then check in with my enhancement crew. So I get to do a lot of different uh, different things. Anyway, I gotta get a price to uh, edge and mulch this bed here. I was gonna ask you guys if you had an idea how much mulch we needed, but it's kinda hard to see. Uh, just for the fun of it. Anyway, gonna grab a price for this and uh, move on they just asked for mulch but I think that if you look at this bed right here it could use some work so I'm gonna flip the camera around and show you guys what I'm talking about so you really can't see I mean the sign actually says the reserve at Pine Lakes Village but you can't see it from the road because the shrubs are so overgrown plus we got a dead taxis over on the left we got another dead dying taxis in the back over there we got lower branches hanging down here in front of the sign. So instead of just mulching this bed and cutting it out, which is a great idea, I also think we should remove the shrubs in the front, trim up the trees, maybe add, I don't know, some gold mop uh, cypress down there on the bottom just to uh, kind of give it some color in front of the sign year round, uh, keep it simple, keep it easy. You know, I don't think they want anything flashy here and it'll just uh, neaten it up a little bit. So if we get the job, I'll try to remember to uh, go ahead and show you guys uh, the after footage. Anyway, yeah, uh, just wanted to kind of show you guys that. That's how you upsell the jobs if you can do it. You know, it's worth uh, shooting the customer an estimate and also on the uh, other end of it, it's kind of doing a favor because it's helping the problem long-term. It'll, it'll look a lot nicer. All right, heading on to the next. Job. The 
doing some path projects here at this uh, subdivision we take care of. Um, we put down the crust limestone and people can, you know, ride their bikes on it, take walks on it, you know. Uh, that's nice. They got a nice lake. Got a couple subdivisions like this where we where we do this kind of work and then we'll kind of go over it and camp it down a little bit. See if we can find the Mo crew. They're here today too. So uh, this place is pretty big. We got a lot of stuff in here. So see if we can find those guys and uh, move on. So yeah, here we do a lot of uh, we pick up all the lawns. Like um, so, we use bagging units here. So we pretty much bag everything, and uh, that's part of the deal for this job. So we take a lot of grass out of here. Mowers. Getting it done. All right, that's it. Um, did what I had to do out here, and I'm heading now to do. Uh, I need to do a little more sales calls, so I'm gonna head back and do some of that. Some of my days are like that, you know, meetings, calls, sales calls, checking on crews, checking out equipment, checking out trucks, making sure things get fixed. Um, not fixing them myself because I'm not much of a mechanic. Um, just a lot of uh, really wearing a lot of hats when you run a company. That's just the way it is, you know, big, small, whatever. Um, I tend to do multiple things. So it keeps it interesting for sure. So I'm going to head back out and do a little bit of uh, sales calls here and uh, see where it takes me after, uh, after this afternoon. It's about 1.30, so still early. Had to make a detour, stop here at the office for a minute. Things change throughout the day. Just have to check in real quick, see what's going on. So I never got to go out and do my sales calls, but I'll tell you guys something. Me and Jeff are gonna be speaking in, where, where are we speaking, Jeff? We got Denver. Denver, West Virginia. West Virginia. I'm gonna be at GIE at the HNA show on the GIE, 19th. don't miss it. Yep. So yeah, um, we'll get to the dates for Denver and uh, Virginia. That's in like January and February. Yeah. Yes. Be a busy winter. Give us a call if you need help with your landscape business. We're here, always. All right, say bye, Jeff. Bye, Jeff. So you guys, thanks for watching. Hit subscribe, leave a comment. Talk to you later.